Blood Rite is a game made by Julian Luciez and Tuan Mole for Ludum Dare 44. I had decided to play through some of the LD games last week, and this one caught my eye due to the striking black and white art style. An intro screen tells you you need to collect three skulls per level, and then you can die the great death of Aldrak. It is also darkly humorous, and even when you win a level, you still die. The only way to avoid dying would be to not play the game. The distinction between winning and losing lies in whether or not your death was meaningful. The sound mainly involves some tribal-sounding drum beats and the crowd cheering, which is very effective. The enemies or obstacles are rather strange. Horses, tentacles coming out of the ground, and a stomper thing that comes from the sky to smash you. It may take a few plays to fully understand, but it's a short game, so this is not a hassle at all. An interesting game dynamic is the way that the time stops when you are not moving. The goal of each level is the same, but difficulty increases due to the fact that there are more enemies and a greater number of enemies, as well as your character starting out injured. You have been cut by Kaldrok, the Holy Knife. With every step, you're painting the floor with a trail of your own blood, and you'll eventually bleed out and die, even if you manage to avoid enemies. This severely limits how much walking around is possible, which is what gives it its puzzle game aspect. This is also a point where I appreciated that time stops. You can move to collect a skull, then move a few steps to see which way the enemies are moving, and then stop and catch your breath while plotting your next moves. I saw some comments suggesting that a grid-based playing field would have been interesting, but I think the way it is would work the best. You really feel like you have complete control over each step that your character takes when moving with the arrow keys. Others suggested color, especially for the blood, but I think that would negatively impact the stylized graphics and the look. Overall, a very solid, funny, enjoyable, but short game. My only wish would be for more levels.